Hi and welcome to our final e-newsletter for Term 1. We have had a big couple of weeks in middle school, led by our Grade 5 and 6 camp last week. Um, to share the reflections on camp, I have Sophie from Grade 5 and Ella from Grade 6. Hi, I'm Ella. Last week, Grade 6's six, went to Camp Kunawara. It was jam-packed with fun field activities like hut building, high and low ropes, rock climbing, flying fox, canoeing and rafting and much more. My favourite activity was canoeing because we got in a big canoe and raced across the lake. The food at camp was great. We had nine meals every day. All the cabins had a chance to show responsibility, which is one of our four arts, and do duty group and set up the tables, then serve and pack up. The, ac the night activities were at camp were so entertaining. The activities were trivia where we had to try and answer questions and win points. H-Factor where we got to show off our talents. Even the teachers had a go. Girls versus boys. The girls cheated and said they won with an above score of 41, but the boys were the real winners with a top score of 40 and, and Ruby night. We all got to bring our pillows and be in our comfy PJs. Can't wait for next camp. Thanks. Last week, all the year fives went on camp at Arabri Lodge. The activities there were super fun. There was archery, flying fox, swimming and more. My favourite activity was swimming. We got amazing food there like fish and chips, lasagna, salad and lots, lots more. I love to spend time with my friends and meeting new friends. I wish I could go back. Thank you Ella and Sophie for your reflections on camp and I know so many other grade fives and sixes had an amazing time last week as did all the teachers. Just a few reminders for our final newsletter. Next Tuesday we have our parent teacher interviews running from 12 till 8 at night. Please make sure you have booked in a compass and remember that it is a, a variation to school day and students won't be required at school apart from their interview time where we certainly encourage you to bring them along with you to speak to your teachers. Our final day is fast approaching which is hard to believe and it is next Thursday before our Easter break. Uh, we are dismissing the students at 2 o'clock and they will be dismissed from their classrooms. Finally, can I just give some thanks, um, firstly to all our amazing staff in the middle school who have worked tirelessly to get the year underway and produce such a brilliant term one. Uh, the students have certainly settled in to their environment, either as a new student or students who have been here previously with us. It's been a very successful term one in middle school and again we thank our staff. Can I also thank our parents for their support. And just a reminder that term two, uh, our winter uniform comes into, into play. It is an amazing uniform, it looks brilliant, um, but I do remind students in years seven and eight that ties are to be worn, and again, blazers are, are to be worn with ties to and from school. Looking forward to seeing you all after the Easter break, and again, thank you.